seaweed contains natural sunblockers, and researchers at King's College London wondered if it could be used to protect humans. The substance found in seaweed is palathine, a kind of naturally occurring amino acid called MAA found in marine organisms. It protects plants and animals that are exposed to sunlight all day long in shallow waters. The team wanted to see how palathine worked on humans. First of all, we grew skin cells in, in a petri dish, basically, and then we can irradiate those and look for markers of UV damage. So they could be uh, DNA damage or markers of photoaging. Um, and then we can apply um, the, the MAAs or the palathine to the cells to see if they're protective after we irradiate. So that's the first step. When we've got good results from this, which we have, we can take this to clinical trials and um, test them in humans. Most sunscreens contain synthetic filters to block UV or ultraviolet rays, which, when washed off, can end up in our rivers and oceans and harm marine life. The research could help in developing a natural product that protects our skin without damaging the environment. We've now been able to do all of the biological tests to actually prove that the MAA compounds are sunscreens. They can absorb in the UVA and UVB, which is quite unique for a single compound. But also what we found is that they act as natural antioxidants. So in a single molecule, we have three beneficial effects. We can protect against UVA, UVB, but also the antioxidant effect as well. The team says more work is needed to prove their findings outside the lab, but they're already working with a cosmetics company and say an MAA-based sunscreen could be on the market as early as this year. Julie Tabo, VOA News.